Good morning, students. In the last class, I taught you about the theory of sound. Right? In this class, I am going to teach you about the sound source. Sound source. First, we need to know what is the sound. Sound is a noise. Right? Is a as this we can hear. Sound can hear. I can't. We can't see. We can't see. Right? How we can classify the sound source? What are the sound sources are available? What are the sound sources are available? We can classify the sound source into two different types. Into two different types. One is the natural sound source. Another one artificial sound source. One is the natural sound source. Another one is the artificial sound source. How we can say it is a natural sound source and it is a artificial sound source? Which are the sound? Which are the sounds will produce naturally? Which are the sounds are produced naturally? That sound sounds are called natural sound sounds. And which are the sounds are produced by a human? Produced by a human effort. That type of sound sounds are called the artificial sound sounds. Right? For natural sound source, we can say animal sounds, wind sounds, flowing stream sounds, and avalanche sounds, and volcanic sounds, etc. Like that, we can say a number of things. Like that, we can say a number of things. When animal animal put in a sound, that is also one of the sound, right? That sounds within. That we limit twenty heads to. That we limit twenty heads to twenty kilohertz means there is no problem. That is, that sound we can able to hear. That sound we can able to hear, right? So that is not a problem. But we need to consider that is a sound. That sound we can. Measure with the help of sound level indicator, right? Already I taught you in the previous class sound level indicator. What are the terms we can find in that sound pressure and sound intensity, right? That we can find with the help of that. With the help of that we can find the quality of the sound, right? Then. Here we know animal sounds. Animal will put a sound, and when the wind is moving, where and where we have a wind, there is a sound that they will produce some noise. That sound, right? When we can say sound, when we can say noise, when we can say sound means. The frequency of the sound is less than twenty kilohertz. Less than twenty kilohertz is called as sound. When the sound frequency is greater than twenty kilohertz, means that is the noise, right? Then here we need to explain artificial sound source. Artificial sound source means. We are making the noise. We are making the noise. Human body. We are making the noise. How we can make? We made a vehicle. We made a vehicle while driving. While driving a vehicle, the engine in the engine produce some noise and the exhaust. Silence produces some noise. Most of the bikes are uh, adjusting the silence of the bike and making more noises, right? Like that, we are making the noises. We are making the noise. That type of noise, where which are the things we made and produce some noise from that. That kind of sound source are called as artificial sound source. These artificial sound source has another 
something that is man made man made sound source man made sound source because all the things we only produce we only made right with the help of that the sound will produce the way is we made we introduce and that is we only introduce and the helicopters machines all the machines all the machines and the trains the explosions explosions uh any in any places explosion uh, it happen means that also we need to consider and every factories and home appliances the home also we are using the uh, grinder mixing right mixer like that we are, we are using different machines from that we are from that create some noises create some sounds right that that and that are the sound sources in the artificial sound source that are the sound sources are considered in the artificial sound source right the next class i will teach you about the sound propagation sound propagation in atmosphere and sound propagation right thank you